Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with the construction, planning and scheduling. So the question is, so the activity, then procedures and duration also given. So there is uh, seven activities are there, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Then corresponding activity procedures also given. So for A activity there is no procedures and uh, activity B there is no procedures. And activity C, uh, A and B activity is the precedent activity. And C for D activity, C is the precedence. So and uh, E activity, C is the precedence and F activity, D and G activity, D and E the procedures. So the corresponding activity and corresponding duration also given. So we have to find out the critical path and the project duration that is critical duration. Okay. So we have to draw the network diagram and uh, find out the different path. So then find out the critical duration. Okay. So now, so for A activity and B activity, there is no precedent activity. So we can draw like this. So A activity. So then B activity also there is no precedence but C activity A and B is the precedent activity. So uh, we have to join the A activity and the B activity. So then only we got uh, C activity as the C for C activity A and B is the precedence. Okay. So now we can draw the C activity. Okay. So for C activity, A and B is the precedent activity. So then uh, we can draw the D activity. So for D activity, C is the precedence. So we can draw like this. So this D activity. So then E activity also, C is the precedent activity. Okay, so next thing is F. So for F activity, D is the precedent activity. So we can draw like this. F activity. So next thing is G activity. For G activity, D and E is the precedent activity. Okay. So D and E is the precedent activity. So we can draw we can draw one dummy activity. So after that we can uh, draw the G activity. Okay, so G uh, for G activity, D and E is the precedent activity. Okay, so next thing is uh, for F activity, D is the only precedence. Okay, so now we can uh, write the corresponding duration for A activity, 3 is the duration, then B activity, 5 is the duration, for C activity, 4 is the duration, then D activity, 6 is the duration, and E activity, 3 is the duration. So then for F activity, uh, 2 is the duration then uh, G activity 4 is the duration. So for dummy activity there is no duration. Okay, so now we can write the uh, different path. So that is A C D F is one path. Okay, so the corresponding duration. So 3 plus 4 plus 6 plus 2. So that is 15 is the duration. So next thing is for B then C then D and F. Okay, so the corresponding duration 5 plus 4 plus 6 plus 2. So that is 17 is the duration. Okay, so next uh, is A, C, D, then A, C, D, then G. So the corresponding duration 3 plus 4 plus 6 plus 4. So again 17 is the answer. Okay, so next thing is A, C, E, G. A, C, E and G. So 3 plus 4 plus 3 plus 4. 14 is the duration. So B, C, E, G. So 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 4. 16 is the answer. Okay, so next thing is B, C, E. D G B C D G so the duration 5 plus 4 plus D plus 4 19 is the answer okay so there is a 6 path so first one is 1 then 2 then 3 so then 4 so then 5, so then 6. 
okay so totally six path so we know the critical path is containing the maximum duration so here the maximum duration is 19 so the critical path is the b c d g is the critical path so b c d g so this is a critical path and the critical duration or project duration is 19 days so this is a method we can solve the problem again we will see next video thank you